guys, it's Lauren. Welcome back to my channel. I have yet another candle review for you today. As you can see, I have my Yankee bag behind me. I did finally get the opportunity to go to Yankee yesterday. Um, how many candles did I get? I stocked up on three full-size candles and then I got two little votives. I was really tempted to do a haul for you guys, um, but I don't like doing candle reviews. Um, slash showing product unless I've burned it um, or at least tried it um, and you'll see why when I get into the review of this candle so um, before I dive into the review of Yankee's uh, pure radiance whisper candle I want to tell you that they do have these candles on promotion the large vase candles on promotion right now for ten dollars a piece there's a limit of five and that is because they are discontinuing the pure radiance line it's being bought out by Woodwick candles so um, if you guys like pure radiance or are interested in pure radiance I would definitely check that out so without further ado let me dive into the scent notes first so of course this is the review for the Yankee candles let me grab it it just looks so pretty sitting there this is for Yankee candle this is their single wick see it has that flat wick it's a crackling candle single wicked pure radiance vase candle 22 ounces burn time between 120 to 160 let me see yeah 120 to 165 hours. Let me read you the scent notes per Yankee's website on this candle first. And let me hold this up for you guys so that way you know what it looks like. I know there's a little bit of a reflective glow. So this is for Whisper and the scent notes include, or description rather, heavenly scent or heavenly sweet and luxurious. Perfume captivates the senses with its quietly enticing beauty. That is the scent description of this candle. Um, it doesn't give us much to go off of. It says that it's a perfume scent. Yes, it most certainly is a perfume scent. Um, that's pretty much all they give us. So to me on cold, this candle is um, almost like a white floral, a very light white floral. I don't typically like um, strong white florals like Lily. It's not like that. It has a hint of a sweet perfume note like it said in the description. Um, it's a really pretty, pretty scent. I actually purchased this. My boyfriend actually picked this one out. He liked it. Um, I was looking for one for our bedroom. So this is like one of those really pretty light, um, perfumey but not crazy perfumey bedroom scents. Now to me, on cold it smells like Ralph Lauren romance for women <laughs> that's what it smells like to me If those of you who are familiar familiar with that scent um, a very very light version of it it's not like strong at all like by any means just like as if you were to maybe use the lotion or do a little spritz and then smell it a couple hours later just kind of the effect of that so to me it smells like a little bit sweeter more floral version of Ralph Lauren romance perfume for women um, now, <sighs> while burning, I burned this for, let's see, two and a half hours last night when I got home, and then I burned it again for another 45 minutes today before I did this review, just to, um, you know, hopefully see if it would throw. Um, but I'm sad to report, you guys, um, Whisper does not throw at all whatsoever. It's literally an unscented candle. Um, it's a gorgeous unscented candle. It's got this gorgeous crackling wick in this super fancy, you know, jar vase, but it doesn't smell at all. There's one other YouTube reviewer, um, candle reviewer who did a review on this candle about two years ago. She said the same exact thing. I also did my research and looked at Yankee's website. There's a couple other reviews of this particular candle. Um, and let's see one of the people who had purchased it did say the same thing they said it was literally unscented the yankee reps did reply to that comment and they did say that this particular candle in that particular line was a lot lighter than they normally are so i don't know if the company was trying to go light on fragrance but this you guys is unscented so even those of you who are like i don't like strong scented candles i just want something you know in the background just a really light scent you will still be disappointed because you cannot smell it um oh it's so it's so disappointing because it smells so pretty. I don't understand how it can smell so, so nice. How the wax, like why does the wax smell so good? And then when heat is applied to it, like you can't smell it at all. Um, they must not have put enough perfume or fragrance oils in this collection. Um, so anyways, if any of you are planning on going to Yankee Candle to purchase your Pure Radiance before they become discontinued and you come across Whisper, I would I wouldn't take it. I really would just pick another candle, save your $10, 
Now, the only reason I guess you could purchase this, $10 still isn't a bad deal. This is still a really gorgeous candle. Um, I do plan on keeping it because um, the vase is just absolutely gorgeous. It's a cute crackling candle and you can use this in conjunction with any other candle. So if you have different scents going and maybe you want the ambiance of having a pretty candle going in the background, you could use this without having to worry about the scents like overpowering each other or kind of commingling and smelling kind of weird. Um, so that would be a good use for this candle, I guess. But let's face it, any of us who are shopping at Yankee or like Bath and Body Works or any of these places and we're buying our candles from there, we want them to smell. So anyways, you guys, if you're going to shop at Yankee, and you come across Whisper, I'm gonna say it's a pass. I just wouldn't waste your time or money on it unless you want a pretty decorative candle. Um, so that's it for today, you guys. Um, I will try my best to try those other candles that I purchased. I have two other large candles I'll be reviewing and burning. Um, give me about a week or so. Hopefully, I'll, I'll try my best to get them up for you as soon as I can, though. So anyways, you guys, um, that's it for today. As always, thank you so much for all the likes. Thank you so much for all the comments. And thank you so much for all of those of you who um, have subscribed to my channel and those of you who comment on my videos it's fun for me to reply back to you um, I do try my best to reply to each and every person who comments on my channel um, if I don't reply right away it's not that I haven't seen it um, it's I try my best to get back to you guys in a timely manner so um, if this is your first time watching my video welcome to my channel um, I post videos typically every week sometimes a little more than twice a week um, it just depends on when I can get my hands on some new candles um, if you are interested and want to see more videos like this hit that subscribe button for those of you who are already subscribed but want to be notified when I upload new videos hit that bell icon in the corner of your screen that will notify you um, as soon as I upload a video that way you don't have to sift through my entire page to see when I've added new content. So anyways, you guys, that's it for today. I hope you're having an awesome day, an awesome evening, whatever time it is you're watching this video. And until next time, we'll see you later. Bye guys.